we all know what happens when you don't pay this, right? We've come back to our cars and seen that monster ticket. It's a kick in the gut, really. Well, tonight I can tell you that a new settlement with the county of Los Angeles may change things for a lot of folks here in L.A. That feeling you get when you see this, a traffic violation or a speeding ticket. The fines are so high, some folks can't pay. But this settlement today between the ACLU and L.A. County may change things. According to this settlement, folks can now claim financial hardship if they do not have the money to pay their tickets. I, I have been there before, like when it was like 200 bucks because it piled up and I'm like barely surviving, moved to L.A. Not surprisingly, news of the arrangement is getting good reviews across town. I know some people might take advantage of it, but most people need it, you know, like the people that's really struggling. The deal says defendants must now be notified of their right to seek an ability to pay, which essentially means if folks get a citation they cannot afford, they can seek a reduction. The now settled case stemmed from two women whose licenses were suspended because they were too poor to pay the fines from various traffic violations. The ACLU claimed the court should have determined whether they had the means to pay those fines. I had one one friend who just let all her parking tickets pile up and they end up taking her car and she just could never pay for it so she's just like I can't do anything about it. The tickets usually come at the very wrong time so I mean we need some help. And not having a car can mean not having a way to get to work. And they have no other ways to get around and they can lose their job or lose opportunities. This settlement comes about a year after the government, the governor signed into law a ban on uh, taking away people's licenses for their traffic fines. This settlement takes things a step further. Reporting live in North Hollywood, I'm Tom Wade, KCAL 9 News.